Welcome to an ACM quick tip video. This lesson will be on how to insert the option or radio button in order to show a specific set of data. To start off, the radio option button can be found under the developer tab. Select the insert briefcase icon, then click on the icon that's a circle. Then click anywhere on the spreadsheet to show the button. An option button wouldn't make sense without an option, so to utilize this button you need to add more than one. After you selected how many you want, right-click and select Format Control. Then click on the button next to Cell Link and select which cell to reference. I usually pick a cell that's out of the way of the data. As you can see, when a different option is chosen, it changes the number above. If we added one more button, it would show a 3. If you want to start a completely different set of buttons, go back to Insert Briefcase and select the Group Box or Form Control. Then when you add buttons in this box, it will require a different function cell, and you can do functions separately from the other option buttons. Next, we use the index function to utilize the cell link. Type in equal sign index parentheses, highlight the range of data you'd like to use, then comma. Next, highlight the rows of interest, then comma. Then click on the link cell and end parentheses. Remember to add dollar signs if you're using a list of data or want a cell selection to stay in place when you copy and paste this formula to other cells. So for here, we go to the corner of the cell block with the formula, click and drag it all down to copy. And there you have it. When we select option for internal engineering, it shows those values. External button shows the external data. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe for more Excel videos. Comment below and tell us what Excel issue you're facing and we'll be glad to help.